Country Wayne was just hilarious. Country, Country Wayne was up here wildin'. Up here uh, <laughs> earlier today, and this is what he said about his relationship with Jess Hilarious, how it ended. I've been in relationships, man. We, we know, know that. <laughs> they didn't work out. <laughs> I know. just left. Oh, you, you oh, okay. Oh, nobody ever left me. So, so what, what's the reason for you Jess leaving? Hilarious ain't leave you? No. Oh. I, I let her say that because, I you know, I'm the type, I'm going to let, she got a brand, but no, nah, I, no, I never got left in my life. Well, Jess Hilarious said, cap! She called him. Let's Definitely hear it. Definitely cap. Big yeah. cap. She cap. She called him, and this is what happened when she called him. I told her I was going to call him on air, though. Hello? Hey, Country Wayne. Good morning. It's the Breakfast Club. What's up with it? You lied! <laughs> I know he like, yo, we, I was just there yesterday. So so we opened up the phone lines, Country Wayne. You lied, Wayne. Wayne. 800-585-1051. We're asking people, <laughs> has your ex ever lied on you? And Jess Hilarious is here, of course, and she's saying you lied on him. He said I lied first. Nah. Now, I ain't never lied on you. She don't lie on me, but... I, I lied on you. What's the first lie I told yeah. about you, sweetie? What is it? Well, it's so many of them. I can't even count. Oh, God. Now it's so many. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Country Wayne's no player. He's just the way his whole demeanor. <laughs> but listen, you <laughs> said you broke up with Jess, Wayne. Yeah, I just left, right? Yeah. Oh, you, you, but you... No, 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 no. All right, so look. So now let me play lawyer because you said you left. I broke up with you and you mm -hmm. left the house that you put me in, by the way. Nah. But you you left it. Because nah. what else you going to do with somebody? But, but what you going to do? I didn't have to leave you. You was in my yeah. house. You left the no, house after I broke up with you. What else you going to do when somebody break up? You going to stay or you going to leave? Yeah. You know you ain't break up with me. It's all good. All right, Wayne. So, so, you got to get broke up with one day. It's all good. Yeah, ain't you no got to get broke up with to leave somebody's house, right? Yeah. And that's what happened. Nah. So who broke I, up with who? Nah, who broke up with who, Wayne? Nah, I left. Ain't no woman ever broke up. <laughs> you see what he <laughs> said? I left. I left. What did he say before we got on air, Carlos? Because we recorded that too. Because we gonna put that out. <laughs> what did he say? I he left. said. He Whoa. said, yeah, yeah. And I left after that. Yeah, you left after we broke up. After I broke up with you, that's what happened. You supposed to leave. You ain't gonna stay, is you? I can't let you lie. Twenty twenty three now, then. Uh, it's 20, it, it could be 2026. It's going to be the same. I broke up with you and you left the house. But I still love you and congratulations on your movie and your book. Help is on the way, Wayne. Because help, help <laughs> need to be on the way for this liar. <laughs> Ain't no way. Oh Ain't gosh. no way. You hey. better not play with me. Hey. Congratulations on your Netflix special, too. Stop. Oh, that Gary got Owens don't got. <laughs> that Gary Owens don't got. I'm going to get a Netflix special and Master P's going to pay me. <laughs> oh, 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 you really oh, playing. Oh, oh, this ain't about, about Wayne no more. Hang up because you all right, Wayne. <laughs> now, Jess. What? You say that man bought you a house? Yes, he did. That's, Dang. What, that's what we all missed in this whole story. I, I, I heard that, but I was like, maybe I ain't yeah, hear that I heard right. I thought maybe she misspoke because no. she no. said that. Nope. No, she you said, always talking about somebody misspeaking. That, that shouldn't be worried now. You know, maybe she misspoke. <laughs> <laughs> we missed. No. Uh, the whole point of this mm. was Jess has good poom poom. That's that it got to be. He you. bought her a house. That's kind of crazy. I'm What's like, damn. Oh, Jess, you can't really say you broke up with a girl and, and she bought you a house and get you out the house that you bought. God and, damn. Yeah. Man. Listen, that, and, and no, Whoa. don't do that because that is not the right narrative that I want to be painted here. I didn't kick him out. We okay. were both. Uh, we are both adults, and we were very adult about the situation. Mm -hmm. I didn't. I felt like it was too much. Mm -hmm. The relationship, you know, I it came out. I was a home wrecker, this, that, and the other. He lied, said about, you know, the divorce or whatever. Got the lawyer to call me, tell me that everything was final and all of mm -hmm. that. And it was just a lot that I had to deal with daily mm -hmm. coming at me and all of that. And he was very supportive, but he understood. And he was like, I do understand. All right, I'm going to just go back to Atlanta. Yeah, I broke up. I put the breakup in place. Yeah. And then he was like... All right, I'm going to leave. What else you going to do when somebody say it's over? Did you keep you the keys stay? to the house? Yeah, did you keep the yeah, house? Yeah, damn, I kept the house, all the furniture that he put in it, Whoa. everything. God damn, I am proud of Jess. Jess. Good crazy. sister, Jess. I'm like, yes. That's just what Go it ahead, is. Crazy. I did. Go ahead, Jess. <laughs> I don't live there no more. I got tenants, but yeah. Wow, Jess. Keep wow. the house a man bought you. Didn't go buy your own house. That's you. boss. Hello. Whoa. <laughs> Stay away from me. <laughs> Stay away from me. So, so now, Gary, no. has an ex ever lied about you? Watch what? Out, but you better watch how you answer this, Gary. Yeah, you right. You right. <laughs> Let's just say we, she exaggerated the truth. Okay. <laughs> what what she say, Gary? You want to share? Listen. You right. We... we we on good terms right now. <laughs> don't, let him, don't, don't, let, don't let him be walking you down no bad road. I ain't trying to mess it up. I ain't mess it up. We, we straight right now. She's good. All right. Very good. Ain't no need to ask me any of that question. We ain't got no exes. Let's go to the phone lines. <laughs> Hello, who's this? Hello, it's Kevin. 
Hey, Kev, now, now I'm reading here, and it says uh, you were dating a white girl, and she lied about you beating her up. That sound about white. Yeah, yeah, just about. Mm. Just about that. I mean, yeah, I was in the college and uh, dating this girl mm. for a little bit. I went to high school with her. Mm. But, um, yeah, I was dating her for about a couple months. And then we broke up for whatever stupid reason. Ended up getting back together a couple weeks later. I'm at our apartment, chilling. And uh, her roommate, I went outside to smoke, and her roommates come home. And they're like, what are you doing here? And I was like, um, and then I with Christine, what do you mean? And she was like, uh, and they were like, you know, you're not supposed to be here. So they go inside. Christine and all of them come out. And she's like, what are you doing here? And I was like, what are you talking about? You said I could stay here. And she was like, nah, you can't be here, da 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 And all of a sudden, one of the roommate's boyfriends punched me. We get into a fight. Next day, I wake up to the police knocking at my door with a restraining order saying that I beat her up. Was selling drugs out of her apartment and all this other jazz. Damn, and, uh, all the black Basically, had to go to court for it. And you got beat yeah, up. Yeah, by the all... Damn. And he beat I you up. Beat up. <clears throat> nah, you got up. Be... I can't. You got oh, beat yo, up. John. Okay, so you're <laughs> black. You're black. Yeah, yeah. Half oh, black. Okay. okay. Oh, you have black. City. Yeah. City. Oh, oh, always like, have the white black. side of you got beat up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, the yeah. White the white side of beat up and the black side came out and held his own. Oh, I know that. Thank you, the black side held his own. Thank you, Kevin. Oh, okay, God. I know that's right. But well, which side man. was dating the girl? Eight hundred five eight five one zero five one. We're asking: Has an ex ever lied on you? We'll talk about it when we come back. It's the Breakfast Club on BET. Morning, everybody. It's DJ MV Charlamagne Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Now, if you just join us, we have our co-hosts here, Gary Owen and Jess Hilarious. Jess Hilarious and Gary Owen. What's That's up? Right. Now, we, uh, this topic came from Jess Hilarious and her ex, Country Wayne. The question is: Has an ex ever lied on you? Uh, on you? You? <laughs> on you? On you? I got it. So, so, Country Wayne was here, and he said that he's never got broken up with. That he's broken up with all the women he was with. And mm-hmm. Jess Larius says, "Cat." She said, "That is a lie. <laughs> That's a lie." <laughs> mm-hmm. And uh, we actually called him earlier. We don't have to play the call again, but she basically called him a liar. Yes. She's sitting right there. I did. Yes. I believe I Jess. Thank you, and don't only believe me because I'm sitting here in your face. I literally I, am telling oh the truth. Oh my God. I have no this. problem saying it in front of Wayne either. Okay, okay. I do believe, I, I believe your story. I believe you broke up. Yeah. He left. Mm-hmm. And I think as a man, you work it out in your brain that yeah. I just left. Mm. We yeah, didn't break up. I left her. I left her. You know, and I think he wanted to maybe keep that undefeated record of nobody leaving him, <laughs> I guess. This you know, or nobody. But that's what I said. Like, but one thing about that man, that one thing I, I, I realized about him very quickly going into this, going into a relationship with him, he's very competitive. No matter mm. What? If you're a man, a woman, mm-hmm. an alien, a dog, whatever. If you are, you can. We could have got married. He is still in com- in, in competition with you. It I can tell you matter. one thing. He lost though. Right. That house. Yeah. He just got he the house. Yeah. Somebody's yeah. old must go. Yeah. Yeah. I thought you were gonna say so, something sweet. I was gonna say he lost that. you, Jess. Yeah, but he, yeah. goes, he goes to the house. Yeah, 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 yeah. He lost. He lost me for sure. Is it a big house? But he's still at the. But it's, hell yeah. I mean, yeah. It was, can I say hell? Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. It was a nice house. It was yeah. a nice house. But. I got a, a nicer, bigger one now, thank you, that I got myself. So that really, that just I just had to flex. I had to sell that one too. I had to flex. I might, I, I might have to sell that you one because I'm about to be the third you host. So it is what I got. I got to move the jersey on it. Keep the closer, property you know? even, 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 even if, you know, God makes things happen. It could be, a, yeah. yeah. But that that's what it, that's what it is. I just want to say to the people, we, I, I broke up and it shouldn't even be a thing of this. It shouldn't even be that. Like, oh, I broke up with her. Nobody ever left me. No, it's the first time for everything, babe. Yeah, it's fine. It's okay. That, that was the first time a guy ever put me in a house. Boom. You got that. Boom. It's the first time that a girl left you. I mean, broke up with you and then you left the house. However you want to say it. Jesus. Damn. Madison. It's a lot. Hello. No, it's Madison. 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 My bad. Madison. <laughs> Okay, yes. good morning. I just want to say I love you guys. And um, before I come with my story, and we, we have the same birthday. I'm September 3rd. I'm a Virgo just like you. Hey, shout out to all the Virgos, September 3rd. Ooh. Yes, September 3rd. And I just want to say I have the same story as Jeff Hilarious. I did pick up with my baby daddy a long time ago, and he went and said that he was the one that left me and that I was crazy and the whole time. And then he, right now he has a new girlfriend. And actually things are crazy. And I'm like, whatever, you can find out yourself. But now she's pregnant. Now she's definitely going through it. 
It's crazy how I can only understand every other word, but understood everything she said. I missed all of it. You missed all of it? She said she got the same story as Jessica Larry. She had a baby daddy. Baby daddy said he broke up with her, said she was crazy. Now that baby daddy's with somebody else, and she's she's pregnant, and she's telling him, welcome to the something baby mama club. Mm-hmm. Boom. All that. Sounds very You got all that out of that? Yes, Gary, we got it. Hello? Hello? Hey, what's your name? Temprano. Temprano. Que pasa? Pasa nada. What'd he say? What'd that mean? Empanada? Empanada? I like empanadas. Pasa nada. <laughs> oh. oh. Was this the green card line this morning? <laughs> what the hell going on, man? Who said it's in the green card line? <laughs> nah, yo, I'm Jamaican. Oh, Jamaican. Oh, Jamaican. That don't mean nothing? Yeah. <laughs> Y'all the main one sometimes. Yo, shut up, man. <laughs> so, good, man. What's the story, brother? So, my ex-wife. I, uh, I was pursuing a career in filmmaking, and my ex-wife told my kids that the reason why we couldn't ever afford to buy a house was because I was pursuing filmmaking. Is that the truth? Yeah, that's the honest truth. Well, then she didn't lie. <laughs> well, no, 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 no. It's the truth that she said that, but oh. that was the truth now. I am so confused. I have His to. wife said they couldn't afford no house or no food because their husband at the time was wanted to be a filmmaker. Was chasing all the his money dreams to uh, be a filmmaker. Did you want to be a filmmaker? You wanted to do the next shatters? No, 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 no. I, I do more dramas. So you wanted to be like a filmmaker? Shatters, yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, I did one film already, I'm, and I'm doing my second one right now. Which so what did she lie that about? This, that I did. this nigga trying to promote some stuff he got going on. That's what <laughs> yeah, <we> got. Get <laughs> ready. <laughs> Guarantee. Said, yo, I have a movie on Tubi. No, no, you know, no, 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 like, no, yo, no, come on, yo. Yeah, nah. coming. <laughs> I picked up on that too. I was like, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, he tried. Yeah, he tried. Well, what's what's the moral of the story if there's a moral? <laughs> what's the moral of the story, Jess? Don't lie on your exes. If you got broke up with, you just got broke up with. It's all right. And honestly, we are really, really good friends. That is the craziest thing. He did say that. Me and yeah, me and Wayne are really good friends we still love each other really good it ain't like that but it's you know what i'm so saying not it's, sleeping it's together cool. no more. oh no never jeez but Jesus. yeah so you ain't spending the block but huh you wouldn't spend the block i can't spend the block unless he get to get another house oh yeah oh, oh, another, 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 another one no i'm joking i'm joking <laughs> no, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't spend a block i wouldn't spend a block now wayne is a really really good friend of mine and that's just it it's always gonna be that like he's cool he's just very very competitive when even when he don't need to be and even when somebody else is a winner he hates it all right. Well, when we come back, we got the room. And, and with that, mean I mean me. It, okay. I just mean me. I ain't you know. Ain't too many people that could <laughs> that could top him. But I'm the one. Okay. So, hey. Yeah. Okay. Whoa. All right. This is the humble morning show. <laughs> <laughs> when we come back, we got your rumor report. Also, we got to talk. Jess is in Connecticut this weekend. We'll tell you about that. And Gary Owen has a new movie that's coming out in a little bit. It is. Yeah. Okay. We did the screen time. last night. Tubi. <laughs> No, it's oh, not. We're on TV. Amazon Prime. Oh. Amazon Why Prime, so baby, and Hulu. Oh, <laughs> talking about Tubi. What? Like Tubi. You got me confused, homie. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about it when we come back. It's The Breakfast Club. Talk about competitive. Wake that ass up. Uh, in the morning. The Breakfast Club.